as I said, I wasn't very talented. And many times throughout my career, I have trained with, swam against, um, been around swimmers who are way, way more talented than I am. But I was always prepared to work a bit harder. From a very young age, I just learned the lesson that if I practiced harder than my friends I was swimming with, I ended up swimming faster than them. So when we were swimming and there were times when they would cheat on their rest or they would miss a rep or they were complaining that the sessions were too hard, I was just loving it and I couldn't understand that whole mentality. And whilst they were better than me, I slowly but surely saw that as I just worked harder and didn't miss reps and didn't cheat on my rest, and worked a little bit harder and really concentrated on the little things that I started to improve at a greater rate. And looking back now, I, am, I understand about the package that it is to make up an international athlete or top athlete of any sport or someone successful in any sport. There's lots of things that go to make up the package. The only part of that package you can't change is the talent you were born with, your natural talent, your God-given talent, whatever it is, you can't change that. You can improve your strength, your physical strength, your mental strength, your skills, your technique, the application. You can improve all of these. The only part of the package you can't improve is your talent. So I'm a firm believer that hard work beats talent in the end. The talent you have is just a head start. Five metres to go. Karen Pickering has held on for the gold medal. Eight, zero, one. 0.39, a new Commonwealth Games record. What an unbelievable team effort from the English ladies.